Hi everybody, we're going to do a Q&A. We're going to talk about how to style a green polo shirt. So we actually ran a video on how to style our other summer polo colors and we forgot to include the green. Um, so we're doing a separate video on how to style the green polo shirt. Alrighty, so here we go. This is it, the green polo shirt for this spring summer. Um, we call it forest green. It's quite a strong saturated green. It's got a little bit of a melange effect. So it goes from kind of light green to dark green in the yarn. Um, it is great with olive chinos as so, uh, but of course like khaki is wonderful as well. And for denim, I like our Nigel jeans. I would advise anyone who's wearing this with jeans to just try and go for the darkest jeans possible. And I'll show you why in a second. This particular green is great, but it's best to get a bit of contrast off of it. Um, so for instance, there's like certain shades of blue, of brown that just could be a little bit better if they were a little bit darker, and you'll see what I mean. So let's start with this. Um, the safari jacket that we just released, this is in a dark brown cotton. And I love this. I think this is great. You know, all the colors kind of make sense together. Um, let me show you something that's a little bit lighter than this. And you guys can tell me if you think it's a good match or it could be better. So this is our Picora Nera. And this is in a chocolate color, but it's not like dark. It's not as dark as what I just had out. Oops. And for me, I kind of prefer this over this. This is not bad, don't get me wrong, but I prefer the darker shade when I'm using this particular shade of green. All right, let's move on. Uh, you know, something that people don't really think about, but I think looks really good is tone on tone using green. Like a lot of people might use it with khaki or with blues, but tone on tone with green is cool too. Um, you'll have to pardon the size of this jacket. Unfortunately, it's not my size. It's a little bit big for me, but you get the idea. I actually really like this together. You know, like all the parts have enough of a difference in terms of their brightness, in terms of their saturation, that they all stand well against each other. Let me also show you, this is actually probably going to be my, this is probably my favorite option. Um, this kind of powdery green, which is already an unusual shade of color, this kind of powdery green next to the forest green and then next to the uh, olive sporcino, I think makes for a really interesting color combination. And then having that peach check just helps to break it up a little bit and make it a little more interesting. Because I think that this works when the when your coat, when your sport coat has a little bit more of a pattern in it. If it was just a flat color, maybe it wouldn't work so well. Okay, uh, finally, let's, oh, actually, well, not quite finally. Um, so we have a few creams to look at as well. The cream against the green is not bad as well. I quite like that. You know, and it's nice to have those earth tones together. I think that works quite well. Uh, another kind of quirky favorite of mine is this. Um, we are mostly sold out of it, but this cloth is actually available in one of the Drapper's cloth books, like one of the summer cloth books. It is uh, Vitaly Barbera's Canonico's um, wool seersucker, and they do it in this really interesting shade of off-white and taupe gray. And you know, when you put these kind of warm-ish but very pale colors together with the green, I think it stands out in a really nice way. And then, finally, let's look at some blues. So, uh, as I was mentioning before, you want to use blues that have a little bit more darkness to them. This one is not bad. Um, it's our spring-summer blue blazer. Uh, but, you know, in terms of, like, brightness and saturation, it's very similar to this green. And so, you don't quite get the, uh, sorry, the contrast that I think you might want. Um, compare this to this, which is a dark navy linen sport coat. See, I like that together better. Let me put the two side by side for you. Uh, 
See, for me, that just like blacker, darker navy works better with the green than this. These I find like, it's not bad, but it's a little, could be better. Alrighty, so that's about it for our little styling guide for the green polo. Uh, it is available online and in store. And you know, if you have any other suggestions for like how this thing could be worn, um, we would love to hear them. All right, but that's it for now. Thanks for watching.